Hey, what's going on everyone? Shri Kanase here and today I'm going to be showing you how you can start accepting cryptocurrency on your Shopify stores. So before we jump into this video, make sure to hit that like button if you guys are finding value in these videos and don't forget to subscribe and turn the post notifications on so you stay up to date with these valuable videos and let me show you how to accept cryptocurrency. So I'm here in my Shopify dashboard for the new store I created and if you guys haven't watched my series on how I created and designed this store and exactly what kind of tweaks I add to my Shopify stores be sure to check my series out you can find the first part of the series in the top right corner it should have popped up by now but I'm here in my Shopify dashboard and the first thing you want to do in order to start accepting cryptocurrency is go over to your settings so just click on settings on the bottom left corner and once it loads up you can see this screen you want to click on payment providers we're going to be changing the payment providers and adding a few others when the page loads this is the first thing you see we're not interested in these parts we want to scroll all the way down to where it says alternative payments and this is where we're going to begin accepting cryptocurrency so just click on the drop down menu and when you click on it, you'll see a bunch of different payment service providers listed over here. We're only interested in the top three and the three that we're going to be using. And you can use either one of these, but the three that I'll be personally going over is Coinbase Commerce, GoCoin, and BitPay. So these are the three cryptocurrency payment providers. And the first one we want to check out is Coinbase Commerce. So just click on that. And when you scroll down, you'll see that it's very simple to set up a Coinbase Commerce account. All you have to do is just click on the link provided over here which takes you to the Coinbase Commerce page and this is actually separate from Coinbase.com so even if you have a Coinbase.com account you're going to have to sign up for a Coinbase Commerce account here. And once you sign up it's really simple all you have to do is paste the Coinbase Commerce email and the Coinbase Commerce API key which you can find on your Coinbase Commerce dashboard into these areas over here. And for the cards accepted it's actually the cryptocurrency accepted so you can either Choose to accept Ethereum, Bitcoin, Litecoin, and Bitcoin Cash. So it's up to you to as to what you want to accept or not. But this is one of the ways you can start accepting cryptocurrency. I've personally gotten into cryptocurrency and have invested around $1,500 to $2,000 into cryptocurrency. And I honestly think it's a very good investment for 2018 and onwards. So this is the best way you can start investing yourself into cryptocurrency. The second payment provider option, which I'll be showing you guys, is BitPay. So just click on BitPay and you'll see this option. Again, this is another website which is different from Coinbase Commerce or Coinbase.com. But you just have to click on BitPay over here and it'll take you to this BitPay.com website. And this is where you get to create an account for BitPay. And basically, once you have done that, just come over here and enter your BitPay API key ID and just hit save. And that's how you start accepting cryptocurrency with BitPay. But for BitPay, as you can tell by the name, all you can accept is Bitcoin. So unless you want to only accept Bitcoin, I would recommend Coinbase Commerce. And the third and final way of accepting cryptocurrency is GoCoin. So just click on GoCoin and you'll see this sheet pop up. So for GoCoin, you get to accept Bitcoin and Litecoin. And again, this is a completely different from Coinbase Commerce or BitPay. So all you have to do is just sign up for a merchant account and begin accepting the cryptocurrency payments. Again, you have to enter your merchant ID. And for GoCoin, it's a different key called HMAC key. And again, you'll find these on the GoCoin dashboard, but just enter them here and click on save and you're good to go. So this was just a quick tutorial on how you can begin accepting cryptocurrency payments on your Shopify store. And I personally think this could also increase your conversion rate because if you accept cryptocurrency, it adds somewhat of a trust factor because it lets the customers know that you have different means of accepting payment, which has a psychological effect on itself. And also people who have more investments in cryptocurrency are easily able to pay via their cryptocurrency instead of having to pay with cash. So if you guys did find value in this videos, make sure to hit that like button and I'll see you guys next time.